what's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my youtube channel today i'm going to basically tell you how to fix the crash on stored up issue in city skylines so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll probably know what to do in order to fix this issue before we start right into the video i just want to you guys know let you guys know that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or your subscription right onto my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. I mean, it's free for you and you will support my work here on YouTube a little bit I'm gonna really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that So anyways, I would just say let's get right started So as the first step I would recommend doing for everybody uh, I would recommend you to restart or not restart to store it or launch your task manager by using the shortcut or navigating down to your taskbar right clicking it and opening up your task manager so once you did that, I want you to um, navigate to the top left corner of your screen just to ensure that you're sticking around processes. And as the next step, I want you to click off on one of those processes and searching for city skylines by just uh, typing C. And once you typed in C, um, if nothing pops up, it's good for you. If something pops up, you should be able to simply just right click and enter task. Once you're finished, you should be able to end this task again. And as the next step, I want you to take your Steam shortcut or your game shortcut on your desktop, doesn't really matter. And if you don't have it on your desktop, just navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, uh, click on the Windows symbol and use your Windows search function in order to find the shortcut and drag it right onto your desktop. So let's quickly come back. If you have it on your desktop, you're gonna right click and navigate down to the, uh, to the properties. Once this tab pops up, click onto compatibility and click on or just enable uh, or just see, copy what I did. So compatibility mode, enable run this program compatibility mode for it, select Windows 8, disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as enable run this program as an administrator, hit apply and OK. Um, I would personally recommend you restart your PC afterwards and once you restart it, you should be able to see um, this little administrator symbol right onto your Steam shortcut or your, or your game shortcut. I want you to double click it and launch it over the launcher. This will probably fix your issue. And that's it for the video, guys. I hope I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment, or a subscription. And I'm really sorry, guys, if I couldn't help you, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one, and bye.